You guys, let's get right to the point. You're gonna help me out today on how to find the perfect lipstick shade. Now, I don't wear a lot of lipsticks because I'm just a liquid lipstick kind of girl. I think I forgot about lipsticks. Like I grew up with lipsticks and liquid lipsticks have dominated the world for the past like eight years. But you guys, recently, Jeffree Star and Jeffree Star Cosmetics just released the new Velvet Trap lipsticks. Now, I have the Velvet Traps lipsticks in my studio here, and I also have the old school ammunition lipsticks. I think they're called like ammos or ammunitions or bullets or some shit. Uh, but these are the old school originals, and these are the new ones just released a few days ago. And I mean, honestly, I'm so gag. And you know what I love about a brand? I love the brand that just kind of keeps you on your toe. I mean, I'm gonna specifically talk about Jeffree Star Cosmetics. They keep you on your toes. Honestly, if you hate them, you love them, you love and you hate them, they're gonna keep coming up with new things, and they're just gonna keep being on top of the pyramid of the makeup game. Honestly, Jeffree Star Cosmetics, to me, is one of the top five cosmetics brand. I'm gonna shut up. Today we're gonna find out my top five favorite Velvet Trap lipsticks. Now, quick information about these lipsticks, you guys. What I do love about it is it's magnetic for all of you drunk girls out there that be at the club trying to touch with your makeup and your lipstick. You know, I've been losing the cap all the time, but these aren't magnetic. This is the full lipstick Velvet Trap. It's almost like this, I wanna say like all matte kind of feel. He has like the Jeffree Star logo here. It is magnetic, so as we can listen, bam. Um, and now this is gonna be the part where you guys want to pay attention. So if you guys pull this one up, this is so beautiful He has the imprinted logo. I don't know what other brand is doing this But I want to say that this is probably the first brand that it's actually imprinting the cosmetic logo onto the lipstick Let's go ahead and see the full lineup of the velvet trap lipsticks There's a total of 20 of them and here it is you guys we have the full Velvet Trap. I mean, it looks like they're all graduating from lipstick school. I don't even fucking know what's going on, but like, I mean, this is so stunning. I'm so excited to play with these today. I'm gonna find out my favorite ones. Um, but you guys, in here, we have a lot of hot pinks. We have blues. We have different shades of cool tones and warm tones. We have violet. We have lavenders. We have a black lipstick. I mean, honestly, there's some shades in here that I'm kind of scared of, and then there's some shades that I'm like, OMG, I'm about to literally to die. I hate doing makeup with a wig on. I don't even know how people do it. Like, like right now, I just want to take this wig off and fucking try on some fucking lipsticks. The game is, out of the 20, I need to know my top five. My top five favorites. And I also want you guys in the comments to let me know which one is your favorite. Like, which one did you think is like the best? Now, I dressed all orange on purpose because that's how you really know you like a lipstick. When you wear something challenging, and I think orange is such a challenging color that I need to know what's going to go with orange. So that's why I'm all looking crazy. I'm going to pair these up with the, the Jeffree Star liners as well he did send over all these liners i think i see more liners than lipstick that's a really 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 good thing all right first we're gonna try out of the 20 is diet mannequin have i seen this shade before i don't know if i've seen it i don't know if i've seen this shade before because when it comes to nudes like you you have to like wear it to kind of know if you like it or not. You can't look at it and be like, I like it. Because you know how sometimes when you shop for a nude and you're like, oh my God, this is like, this is cute, but I don't live. It look like shit. I look like a dead zombie. And sometimes zombie ain't cute. You know what I mean? Like we ain't trying to look like zombies all the time. I'm going to take birthday suite liner and I'm just going to line my lips just a tad bit. So I'll take in the liner birthday suit and let's go ahead and line softly. I actually really do love this liner. I actually use this liner with a gloss. It's kind of there, but it's kind of not, but it's there, you know? All right, you guys, pulling out Diet Mannequin. <sighs> Oh my god, this is actually really pretty. Oh wow. Oh wow. You know what? Okay, I actually like it with my skin tone. It doesn't wash me out. I think it gave me like a peachy kind of feel. I think it definitely looks exactly like the lipstick though. And honestly, the texture is very like, I wanna say velvety. Like it's almost like, it's not like a cream sheen. It's not like slippery. It's not like kind of wet. It's kind of like really velvety. Like I kind of feel like you just drag it and it's like on. It's kind of cute, huh? My husband's right here. Do you like it? This color is probably going to be my favorite. Oh my god, I kind of like it. Now, I don't think I want to call it Diet Mannequin. I want to call it like that girl with that little voice, you know, like that girl. Oh my god. And it's not too much with the orange. Fuck, I still got like 19 more to try. Diet Mannequin, so far, yeah, very bad. All right, now I have Neutrogena wipes here. My lips are going to be very, very, very dry. Uh, but it's okay because I have five favorite colors with dry lips. All right, you guys. So next we have, oh, 
I love this one. This is Celebrity Skin. Um, I do like Celebrity Skin with a darker liner. So let's go ahead and see if it's like, if it looks like Celebrity Skin as if I was got, getting like the Velour Liquid Lipstick because I do love the Velour Liquid Lipstick version. Got Leo Liner. Now I love Leo with this. It's, it's just my favorite combination, but let's see if it really looks like the Velour Liquid Lipstick. I love Leo. I feel like Jeffrey needs to make a lipstick and a liner after my sign, Sagittarius. Oh, I love Leo. Leo is sickening. So let's go ahead and put on celebrity skin. Now, I know I look a little crazy. Now, I'm doing my lips very fast, okay? I love this color. I think it does look like the liquid lipstick. Am I a little terrified of my look right now? Yes. Y'all can see it on my face. I, I'm, I'm like scared. It's too much orange. This is too like cold. Like it looked like I just like kissed some ice or something like I, I don't even know But I don't think this goes with this situation. Yeah, let's take it off. Okay. All right, you guys next color Let's pick what about this one? Ooh. Now this looks like me naked body Okay, mm, naked body. I'm kind of into it. I think this is a new one naked body I don't think I've ever heard of this color. All right, so let's kind of see the color. Oh Yeah, oh my god I love this one. Oh my god, I love this one. I need a liner that goes with it though. Oh my god, I think this one goes way better. OMG, okay. Oh my god, I'm a little torn between this and Diet Mannequin. You know what, I'm, I'm not, I'm gonna be honest. I like Diet Mannequin better, yeah. I like Diet Mannequin better. This is Naked Body, sickening. All right guys, next we're gonna get a little bit more pink. So there's one called Nudist Colony. Oh God, that sounds crazy. Okay, Nudist Colony, let's try it. Oh my God, this is actually kind of pretty. Oh my God, I kind of like that. I kind of like that. Hmm, hmm. All right, you guys, I like it, but I don't know if it's like, if it, the look is too much or what, what's going on. You know how I know I like it? Cause I didn't take it off yet. I do like it. Let me just try a little liner. Ooh, what about Scorpio? Scorpio and this, let's see. Oh no, 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 that ain't cute. I honestly can see this with like lavender, our blonde hair, wing liner, fluffy lashes. Like I can kind of see it, but I think for today's look, it's a little too like, like old girl, no. Mm -mm. I don't think so, not for today. All right, you guys, so far, like my favorite is Diet Mannequin. Hands down, Diet Mannequin, like obsessed. Okay, oh, there's another light pink one here. So now this one's called Funeral, Funeral Pallor? Parlor? Funeral Parlor. What's a mortuary? Like where you take a dead person. <laughs> Oh, bitch. This thing. A funeral parlor? I don't even want to go there. Like, I'm, like, scared. Let's go and try this on. I'm a little scared. Oh, hell no. What the heck? Nah. I'm kind of in love with it. Oh, my God. You know what this reminds me of? This reminds me of the color where people go shopping for nude. And this is what they would pick. Like, this is the shade every person would pick when they go look for, like, a nude. They'd be like, you know, I want a nude. I'm like, okay, what kind? They're like, like a nude. Like this. I'm like, you, you mean, like, Dead? <laughs> no, not today's look. No, baby. It reminds me of Nudist Colony, but like more intense. You know, like this is like intense. This one's staring at me. Honey, suck me. Ooh, bitch, she's so nasty. This is definitely a suck me color. Oh, like suck my honey. No, people don't say that. <laughs> what are you wearing, honey, suck me? Okay. I don't know, I kinda like it. Oh, this is pretty. Oh, this is so fucking pretty. I don't even think I wanna call it Honey Suck Me. I think I should just call this, this is fucking pretty. That's what it should be called. Oh my God. Wow, this is really pretty. This is like a favorite. Yeah, I'm very into it. Is this top five, you guys? Hmm. You know what, I'm gonna put this on the maybe. Honestly, I could see everybody wearing this color. Like, it makes me look so tan, but I can also see this on someone super pale that's so like, Ooh, you know what I mean? Like, I think this is this is hot. I'm into it. Like, I'm feeling like I want to order a steak. I like a steak. Are you sure? Yeah, definitely. Next light one. Ooh, I I really want to fucking try this one. Oh my god, this is Malibu Beach House. Very lavender. I love it. I love a good lavender. You know what this color reminds me of? A long time ago, Nicki Minaj came out with Nicki 2 MAC Cosmetics. This was her lipstick shade. Like, not her exactly, because I don't, I don't think Velvet existed back then. I don't think it was matte, so that's why I think this is definitely different. If it reminds me of Nicki 2, I'm gonna gag because I ran out of that lipstick. I love that color so much, and it's so hard to find like a lavender. I'm gonna shut up and put it on. 
Oh my god, this is just like it. Oh my god. Oh, this is top. This is top fucking five. Remember back in the day, MySpace? Yeah, this, this is this is way before you guys' this time. MySpace was the time where people didn't really judge anybody, you know what I mean? Yeah, this is top five. Diet Mannequin, Malibu Beach House, definitely my top right now. Okay, I need three more. Alrighty, guys, next, let's do this coral one. This coral one looks really pretty. This one is called Watermelon Soda. This is like a very vibrant fun color. I'm gonna definitely need to pair this with a liner though. Oh, I don't think there's an exact liner to match this actually. Um, but a little tip and trick you guys, taking a brush, you can definitely draw it and I'm gonna show you guys how to do it right now. So if you guys don't have a liner, a little tip and trick, it's not the end of the world. Uh, you wanna take a brush um, and then this is how you can kind of create your own liner um, and really shape your lip perfectly. So let's go ahead and do that today so I can teach you guys something on my channel. We're gonna walk away with a little knowledge on how to create a liner out of a lipstick. So this is what you do. You take your brush and you just kind of draw like that. Oh wow. Oh bitch, I think this is it. <gasps> this with the look today is everything. Oh my God. Oh my God, I love this color. I love this color. Like this color, mm. This is like when you wanna order lobster. Yeah, this is it. Okay, yeah, this is gonna go on my favorites. Wow, this is a beautiful fucking color. It's like coral, pink, red, all in one. Because I'm wearing orange, I think we need to put a little orange on. This is it, you guys. Firestarter is super orange. It reminds me of like a very deeper like version of the watermelon soda. Um, this is definitely giving me like summer vibes. You know, honestly, when I'm shopping, I don't really pick up lipsticks this color because when I get something this color, Honestly, just for me, I would want something more orange. Like this is one of those like between colors that we don't really speak about uh, and watch. Honestly, I will probably like it <laughs> once I put it on. So getting my little brush. So now let's go ahead and put some on the bottom. Yeah, I, I knew this color. It's like the mom version of watermelon soda. Like it's pretty. For this outfit today, it's like giving me very monochromatic. I'm not like mad at it, but I don't think I want to put it more on. I would prefer the watermelon soda over this. I do like this though. Let's, let's kind of change it up a little bit. I'm a little scared by this color. This color is called Unfazed. And um, I don't know how I feel about this color. It's giving me like nude camouflage. It's a really pretty color. Like I honestly have never seen this in a lipstick. Get all up in this again. Like this color. I'm scared. I'm postponing the time. I don't know about this. I'm not looking. Oh, hell no. I think this should be called dead. I got murdered. Uh, here's the thing. Let me dress it up a little bit. Let me do this. Okay, blur it out a little bit. I think for my skin tone, it's too nude. I think it's a cool color, but it's not with this. You would, mm -hmm. It would have to be a very specific look. You know what? I actually like it on versus looking at it. It's not a top five for me, but I, I, I like it. Like, I'm not against it. Let's go back a little bit. Let's kind of see from a distance. Let me, let me pose for you. You see? I don't know what you're supposed to see, but um, you know what I mean, you see? It's like photo shoot lip. This is editorial wet hair, just very like that girl. Honestly, these lipsticks are not drying my lips out at all. Like, my lips don't feel dry. Next, we're gonna jump into this gray. Now, this gray is called Drill Sergeant. Okay. This is gonna need a liner. I'm gonna, I'm gonna really, really fucking line this up because I really do like this color. Like I'm very into this color. This color is giving me very like army, dark, um, sultry. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna do my best to make this like super stunning. Let's try it on. Oh hell no, no. Oh my god, no. I don't think for this look today. I do like it. No, 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 no. I can't. It actually looks really good with dirty money, but I don't I don't think, no, not today, not today, Miss Thing. I think it would look better if I wore like a nude. There's a color here that I wanna try, and I really hope I like it because this is so sexy. This is such a sexy color. This is called Chocolate Fondue. This is so fucking beautiful. Like, I'm like literally looking at it and I wanna like eat it. Let's try it. I think I like it. Take the brush. Oh my god, I actually love this color. I love this color. <gasps> oh, wow. I actually really love this color. Yeah, this is pretty pretty. This is definitely top five. Like, this is such a Kimura color. Like, I, I would wear this just like on a regular. Like, I love this color. I, I don't really mind it with the orange. Now, would I wear it with the orange on a regular? No. Chocolate fondue, bitch. This is everything. All right, so you guys, so far we got 
Diet Mannequin. Watermelon Soda, by the way, which uh, was amazing. I was obsessed with that one. Uh, Malibu Beach House and Chocolate Fondue. Those are honestly colors that I would not think I would pick, but I I'm gag. Moving on, let's go ahead and get on the blue. I already know I'm not gonna like this. It's really hard for me to wear blue lips. Like, I really don't fucking wear blue lips. Like, I'm very scared of it. Like, don't even try to tell me do this water ice. I just think of like water ice and air and shit. You know what I mean? Like, I just, that's what I think of. Okay, let's see. No. Mm -mm -mm. No, not for me. I would wear this for a quick selfie. That is it. Ooh, bitch, I gotta do a lip mask after this. Fuck! Okay, I hate pink. I, I, I hate pink. I just don't fuck with pink. Oh, okay. This is called Hot Kamadi. I don't like hot pink. Okay, I'm gonna try it. Not bad. I kinda like it. Yeah, it's a good color. Oh my God, I kinda like it. Let me finish. Oh. What is going on here, y'all? I tried so many fucking hot pinks and I can't stand it and I don't know why I like this one. Why do I like this one? OMG. I don't know if I like it because of what I'm wearing. I really wanna say this is in my like maybe top five. Like I'm actually fucking gagged. Jeffrey, what the fuck, girl? This is such a hot, hot fucking pink color that I love. I don't know what the fuck it is, but I've tried so many hot pinks and I'm just like, ill, gross. Yeah, I'm putting this in the maybe. The maybe, cause y'all listen, I got one more fucking spot. What is it called? Commodity. Oh, <laughs> wow, it's a good pink. Damn, girl, that shit fucking stained my face. Next, let's go ahead and try this red. Now this red is called the perfect red. Oh shit, the perfect fucking red. Now let me tell you what I look in a fucking red. I want the perfect blue undertone, meaning like I feel like a perfect red is a red that just everybody likes it. Like, you know how some red looks peach and they be saying it's red? And I'm like, girl, that ain't red, that's fucking peach. So far, looking at this, this definitely looks like a red that I would pick up. Now, when it comes to red, like I said, I want it to be so Marilyn Monroe. I want it to be so luxurious. Like, I want this red to go with a black smoky eye. Also with a green eye. You know what I mean? Like, that's a good red. So let's kind of see what this red looks like. Oh, wow. Wow. This red is actually really pretty. You know what it reminds me of? It reminds me of the Louboutin lipstick. Yeah, so far, this red is dope. I'm gonna pair it with Red Rum is by far my favorite red lipstick from Jeffree Star Cosmetics. It's just so sickening. I wear it all the time. Let me see if this liner goes with it because it's the perfect red. Oh, wow. Wow. Oh, shit. Not with today's outfit, but let me tell you, I, I would say it's the perfect red. I mean, I think I could see everybody wear this color. I'm into it. Oh my god, you guys, my lips are like feeling cut. Wow, okay, let's try this one. So this one is called, oh, I know what unicorn blood is. I know this is gonna be exactly what I think it's gonna be, like I, I already could tell. The formula is what's important, you guys, because between a lipstick and a velour li liquid lipstick. So let's go ahead and just do a little bit and kind of test what this looks like. Yeah, I know what this looks like. Actually, it's not one of my favorite colors because it's a little too dark. Now, if I'm gonna go dark, I wanna go more of like, like a wine dark, you know? Let's go ahead and try this green one. This hunter green is so beautiful. This one's called So Jaded. I love the name. It's totally my vibe. This is definitely, like, I would wear this with like a very like smoky brown chocolate eye. I already could tell this is not gonna go with my look today. So let's go ahead and see what it looks like. Yeah, I already can tell. <laughs> Oh my God, I look crazy. I, oh, not with this, not with this outfit, Miss Thing. You need to fucking leave. You need to exit the premises immediately. But you know what? It's a sexy green. I would definitely do a look with that later. I know what this one is. I know Dominatrix. I actually wear Dominatrix. This is the dark color that I was talking about. Like this is the shade. Let's see how stunning this color is. I'm telling you right now, I wear this color all the time. Watch this. Like this is the shade that I like. I prefer this shade. I love Dominatrix. I wear it all the time. Oh, I love this color. Like, honestly, like, Dominatrix to me is just, it's fucking goals. Oh my god, you guys, my lips are about to fall off. I don't know who the hell is putting on 20 lipsticks in like 10 minutes. Two more lipsticks, you guys. Two more. This is medieval. Look how sexy this is. Oh my god. <sighs> okay. Oh my god. Oh yeah, I'm not gonna finish this because I already know this is gonna be in the top five. I think it's gonna be a maybe. Let me just fucking finish this. Fucking, oh my God, this is so sexy. Oh, I love this color. Like this is the wine color that I'm talking about. Like it's just like sexy wine. Oh my God, I love it. Hands down. All right, so this is gonna go in my pile 
that I'm like, oh my God, it might be. Look at my fucking lips. <laughs> I just fucking slobbered. Last but not least, black as hell. Jeffree Star literally popped my cherry because I don't own a black lipstick. Like, where am I going with this? Um, So this will be my first black lipstick I have in the studio. I also have here a liner called Weirdo and Pure Hell Lipstick. Pure Hell? Oh, girl. Take me there. All right, so this is the Pure Hell Black Lipstick. I'm very excited to try this because I don't even know if I'm gonna like it. I do love black lipsticks. I think black lipsticks is very sexy um, when the occasion calls for it. Now, would I wear black lipstick on a regular? Absolutely not. So let's go ahead and see what I look like in black lipstick. <sighs> this is like super black and I'm actually like not mad about it. I actually really like it. Wow, okay. Weirdo liner, wow, it's definitely a color. I'm actually very in love with it, with the orange. Oh my gosh. Oh my God, that's so beautiful. I love it together, huh? It's like sexy. Oh my God. Yeah, this is my fifth one. Top five, y'all. Okay, wow. I love this lipstick color. I love black. I love a black lipstick. Hi, Kamara Black, hello. All right, you guys, so let's go ahead and go over my top five favorites from the Velvet Trap collection. I'm, I'm very gag. I'm gonna keep this black on because I am Feeling it. Number one, my favorite lipstick starting off is Diet Mannequin. Diet Mannequin is so beautiful. I love it. It's like a perfect nude. I'm in love with this. It gave me like a dead, sexy, very like hot girl kind of vibe. Um, second, I am absolutely obsessed with watermelon soda. So this is watermelon soda. Totally a good vibe. Like honestly, it's giving me very like very girly, very fun, very out there. I love bright colors. Oh my god, I drive a convertible. Ball, like oh my god and then I really did enjoy this shade which is called Malibu Beach House this was definitely a shade that I did not think I would like I actually was gagged you guys literally saw my face when I put this on I was very gagged about it now my fourth favorite shade I did love is chocolate fondue chocolate fondue was like the perfect brown for me it was giving me very like sultry sexy I want to say like very fall I see this with like blonde hair in a bun tight and just sex like this is a sex lip i love this color and then last but not least i had to pick pure hell this black lipstick is everything i'm gagged like i'm just so like wow <laughs> i'm like looking in my mirror right here and i'm like I, I can't stop i do have to definitely say like this pink one called hot commodity is so sexy like i said i'm, I'm not a pink magenta person but this definitely gave me a different perspective in the shade magenta pink i had so much fun Figuring out my top five favorites. Like I said, these lipstick shades are so phenomenal. I love the choice of color. I love the vibe. In the comments down below, like, let me know, like, which color was your favorite. I, I mean, I love my top five, but I want to know which shade did you guys like the most. Um, I'm very curious because there is one that I kind of want to, like, try again. Unfazed, to me, is such a sex model color that I'm going to create a look for this. Now, go ahead. If you guys like this video, give me a thumbs up. If Also, if you guys want to see me every single week, make sure you guys hit that subscribe button right here. Go ahead and do it. So in the meantime, I love you and I will see you guys next week.